All right, so let's get a little quick video today. Um, this is the city of Inverness. I hope I pronounced that right. And this is the Cooter Pond Park. It's right next to the, uh, as you come in the, across the water here, I can't remember, I don't know the name of the body of water, but there's a sheriff stations right here. And then of course, this is downtown Inverness over here with all of the, uh, the city uh, government offices. But I did want to show you this uh, walkway. The last time I was here, uh, you can see that these are um, treated boards. You know, one complaint I've had it in Florida is they always just use treated wood. Whereas this, uh, this vinyl uh, uh, mix board here should last quite some time. And they redid this whole walkway and uh, it's really, really pretty. I got a couple people coming up. Let's uh, cut the video off there. But what's cool is right over here you got the helicopter pad right next to the uh, sheriff's station. So when they do have an emergency, um, they can bring them in. You know what, let's just keep the video on. Looks like they're moving on. I'll just keep it off to the side. And I uh, just want to show you what this looks like. Because uh, talk about a great place to have a picnic. And in Vernus, oh my God, the restaurants here are outstanding. Um, so let's take a look. Now I have asked about fishing. I don't know what this is right here. I... Uh, Man, if you're watching this video, and you know what that is. Uh, let's ask these guys. They might know. Hey, do y'all know what this thing is right here? What? You know yes. what the... Yeah, what is that? That pulls all the water hyacinths out of the water and, and all this stuff right here. The weeds. Oh, it's for pulling the weeds out of the yeah. water? With those water hyacinths, I, I heard years ago that these were introduced to the, to the lakes and then they just took over. So now they're kind of not, they're not indigenous, and so now they gotta pull them out all the time, otherwise it just clogs up everything. Oh, okay. I'd never, I'd never seen that thing many times, and I was like, what in the world is that thing for? All right. Well, thanks guys. Appreciate it. I didn't get your face on the video, don't yeah, worry. This is for YouTube. I just wanted to know what that was. Thank you. Thank you. All right, so there you go. It's uh, for cleaning out non-indigenous plants from the, uh, the pond. And uh, let's get out here. Boy, the fountain's not on. That's a bummer. Um, but I uh, just, we'll just take a brief video. Actually, we'll head over to the, uh, the other side. But look here, you know, look, isn't this cool? You got a picnic table right here where you can just, you're almost out in the marsh here. And uh, usually there's a big fountain right, right there in the center center that goes up, I, you know, hard to keep them things operational. And I, I know they're pretty, but uh, I just don't think it's worth taxpayer expense. My community, we got a fountain too. And, and I'm like, you know, when I pay those HOA fees, I just assume, you know, I have to turn that fountain into something prettier, I'd like a goldfish pond and, uh, and just get rid of the fountain so that we don't have to pay that money and, uh, and just have one of those motors that just churns the water to keep it aerated for the fish. I'd much rather see fish than a fountain. But uh, so you see this little short boardwalk. Uh, there's more picnic, another picnic area right over here. There's a sheriff's station, so you're perfectly safe. Lots of law enforcement in Florida. We don't defund our police. And, uh, and then there's actually a trail that goes along here, and that's gonna connect with the bike trail. I don't know how long I've got, because I got someone coming to pick me up. And uh, whenever they get here, I'll have to cut off the video at that point. But uh, let's just keep going. All right, I didn't get far because I forgot to tell you about the one thing that's really cool. Uh, it's kind of like Christmas time here in Inverness. Uh, if you want to come out here, these are these are lights. See that right there, over there, there, going down. They're all solar powered. Uh, well, maybe not. I mean, I, I thought they were solar powered. I, I think there's a uh, they're, uh, they're probably on the grid. Sorry, but uh, this thing is lit up at night and it's really really beautiful. So uh, here's another little picnic area, uh, kind of out here in the swamp. Um, boy, I tell you, this, these boards were looking rough before they redid it all. Let's just get a little bit of um, birds of Cooter Pond. Healthy numbers of fish and other aquatic organisms in Cooter Pond <coughs> and bring a variety of birds which prey upon them. So, and then of course over here, I always read the signs, you know, our favorite turtle. The namesake of Cooter Pond is the big aquatic turtle found throughout Florida. A variety found locally in Peninsula Cooter have a high domed shell and yellow head stripes. Uh, so maybe we'll get to see a turtle. Uh, you can read the rest of that. You can pause right here. Um, 
So we're going to continue on another little picnic area there, and uh, we'll get the we'll get the trail going up to the bike path. So I thought this was awesome. <laughs> Isn't that cool? I you know I wonder who sculpts this stuff. And look at the landscaping here at the pond. And uh, anyway, we just I just came through. See that gazebo there? That is really really nice. And the, even the lights are they're actually lit up right now. I guess because it's a little bit overcast. But let's walk around and just get you the. The introduction to the park, isn't that cool? I mean, they did a hell of a job. All right, let's let's get back on the trail. So here's a bug caught in a spider web, but I don't see the spider. Check him out. Huh. Pretty cool, huh? All right. So we're heading on over to the next gazebo. Lots of places to picnic. And you know what? I'm going to get one of these lights lit up real quick. Here you go. Just to show you kind of what it looks like. I don't know why it's lit during the day. Wouldn't that be cool at night? See how that would be flashing? And uh, like I said, it's like a like a little uh, light show every every night in the evenings here on this little uh, Cooper Pond. All right. Thought I'd get this real quick on the video, because uh, you know the snowbirds do come down here quite often. Um, but look, you got the—I uh, don't know what the Cooter Festival would be, the, the 25th to the 27th of October. Uh, the Festival of Arts. I'm not an artsy person, but uh, some people enjoy that type of thing. And then you got the old-fashioned Christmas. That's the Jingle and Mingle Holiday Party. And then who knows what Friday Night Thunder is? That's the third Friday, I guess, of each month. And uh, there's the website. It's called visitinvernessfl.com. That's visitinvernessfl.com. By the way, I'd like I said that Inverness is probably one of my favorite places in Florida to visit. You know, excellent dining, lots of scenery, a huge, long, uh, I, I want to say 70 or further bike path that you can get on. Uh, wonderful downtown, lots of activities, uh, just a they even have a speedway near here um, where uh, I, I know that uh, I don't think it's uh, well it could be NASCAR I don't know I've just seen some local racing going on there um, but anyway let's uh, hopefully get up to the bike path we'll show you that uh, in, in case you ever come this way you know you, you were looking at uh, the hike ending right here at this picnic shelter but it does not um, it doesn't look like a path. I'm just going to show you this real quick, but it goes Right along here Okay, right by the pond and you can just kind of go on up this way into the woods So let's go on that way and I'll show you what it looks like So let's show you a kind of a different look So we're just hiking along this little grassy path along the side of the pond and uh, What a view, huh? You can see it just kind of you know, there's the there's the walkway that we came across and I haven't gone very far, but I just love this view because you know we're kind of getting where we're not even going to be able to see the pond shortly. So this is this this is the grassy little trail. You know, once again, I, it's just shocking. I mean, the weather's it's a little warm, but uh, I'm always surprised when I don't see anybody out here. I don't know if you can see. We're not going to get it on the film, but uh, on this end of the pond, there's a couple of benches where you could sit if you're going to hike around the pond and. Uh, have a picnic and just look out over the water. Okay, so let's uh, let's just try to get on up to the bike path, and I'll show you where that connects. Uh, there were some uh, some homeless people up here the last time I was here. Let's see if uh, they still got their home there. We'll find out. So this is cool. We're still beside the pond. Nice transition into the forest here. Uh, hey, I know nobody. <laughs> Nobody cares, but you know what? I am getting back to about 90% of my old self. Um, I because I haven't, you know, that's why no videos have gone up for a while. I just, well, not only the rain, it's just been tremendous amounts of rain to get out and do a hike, um, but I just haven't had any energy ever since that. Uh, well, if you follow my videos, you know, I was in the hospital for quite some time, but uh, still waiting, <laughs> still waiting on the results. That's the VA in action. But see how this is, this is, it's kind of cool, isn't it? it you just, now you're feeling kind of weird, like uh, you're in a different place. Uh, and the trail's coming up by this wall. Of course, we've got the, 
graffiti here. Everybody's got to paint on something. And uh, so we're coming up to what I think is the bike path. We'll just get that on the video. And uh, this is what I was talking about because I was uh, I was actually the, how I found all this was I was out biking. Uh, I made a video and I don't even know if I've posted it. I got to go back through the videos and see uh, what I put up as far as Inverness. I don't think I ever got that video up. I might have lost the video because that was when my phone got <laughs> ran over by a car. <laughs> oh my god! But you can see, isn't this cool? This is the uh, this is the Inverness bike path. So you can come and ride for miles and miles. It's beautiful, absolutely gorgeous. Uh, now it's not it's not like um, the Santos where you stay in the forest. This kind of winds out into some populated areas, but uh, and you do cross a lot of streets uh, more so than on the um, the Santos. But uh, it's still a nice ride. And then you got this going this way, and there's those benches I was showing you from the other side just right off of the bike path. So you could literally ride up from downtown. There's a, a David's Cycle World. If you want to search on your phone, you can always park. I always park there. Uh, and I, I go in and look around. Sometimes I might find something that I want. And um, and then I just get on the bike path down there and you can ride up to right here. Uh, now I think this is just gonna go right up to the road, but I'm gonna hike up it. I probably won't get any video there. This might be the end of the video. I'm waiting on the... Uh, the guy from the car dealership to pick me up so that I can go pick up my new car um, but uh, you can see you're just riding along you come to this bridge and just go this way and it takes you on back to the sheriff station beautiful beautiful day all right so let's just continue with the video so I just came up this from the bike path I told you probably just kind of wind right up here uh, and what this is 44 right here east west and then Right up here at Fort Cooper State Park, uh, nice place, uh, really good picnic shelters. Uh, there's some hiking back in there, I haven't done it. Someday we'll get a uh, uh, get a video, look at here, there's two. There's probably a trail right here that's going down towards the state park. And uh, I just wanted to, to show you what Inverness looks like. Now you've got this wonderful lake coming up right here. Um, you know, you had Cooper Pond back there, and uh, I don't know, Gulf, Gulf to Lake, I don't know what the name of this lake is, I'll have to get it at some point, but uh, I just wanted to show you, I saw some people out fishing, I bet there's great fishing in there, um, the bike trail, uh, there's a real nice view down this way on the bike trail, once you get past the downtown, um, you know, lots of people out boating, uh, that's one thing we have here in Florida is lots and lots of lakes, uh, lots of fishing, uh, lots of outdoor activity. But I just kind of wanted to show you this real quick. Uh, but you could just, you know, literally just kind of hike along the, the lake here and have a real nice view. Down this way is a, a VFW for you veterans. Uh, outstanding place. People are super friendly. Uh, there was no virus here in Vernus. <laughs> I went in there back. What was it? Uh, May or June, it might have been June, and uh, they have a play in bingo, and the place was packed. And no masks, no masks. Uh, Fachi, you idiot. You know, they, they, nobody here listens to your dumb ass, but uh, yeah, no masks at the VFW here in Inverness ever. That I, in my, you know, I didn't spend every day at the VFW there, but it was nice, nice to go in there and get a beer after hiking around. So, anyway, I'm gonna let's go check this trail out over here. Still waiting on my ride. There's a McDonald's. I'm gonna head down and maybe get a burger and I'll just wait at the McDonald's for him. I gotta get him on the phone and uh, see if I don't want him looking for me. All right. All right, this is just going back to the bike trail, but I did want to get the name here. It's the With La Coochie, With La Coochie State Trail. That's W-I-T-H-L-A-C-O-O-C-H-E-E. -E. Imagine if you looked that up for a bike trail you'd find it on the map and uh and it'll bring you right here if you want to do some bicycling um all right that, that should be it i'm heading on to the mcdonald's to wait for my ride and uh we'll just make this a brief video sometimes it's nice to just show you a park and get out and just do a little bit of exercise bye bye